namaste teens are born or made still remains to be an interesting topic in the management world leader or a swami is a mindset it is beyond title role power there are many leadership competency models available today and organizations use this models for development and performance management still we hardly find any managers or leaders to be a role model we all recently witnessed or experienced great resignation which shows there is a need for in depth understanding of a true leadership and yes this true leadership understanding is already available in kartalya artishas which talks about 51 excellences of a leader if you are on a journey of a swamihood or a leadership you must go through these 51 excellences this is very effective and relevant irrespective of the size of your organization your work experience the country you live in your age the kind of business um a spread you have or the culture you come from and to let you know the, these 51 excellences are segregated into four different broad categories and one of them is about learning learning attitude meaning absorption of knowledge and how do you constantly keep enhancing this so learning attitude category is itself a very broad category we will look at three excellences covered under this category that is shushrusha shravan grahan and yes there are more under this but today we'll look at only these three categories shushrusha shushrusha meaning has been a burning desire to learn or hunger to know more about people passionately curious to explore new things or to not only this increasing knowledge so as a people manager you may want to know more about your own team right or as a leader you want to explore what's the new in the technology world like the digital transformation shravan so when you are connecting with your team member are you listening with your mind heart and body this is shravan grahan is all about absorbing that which has been ingested a very simple example which you can all relate to is a you know a child learning to grow he's when he's learning to grow he's so excited and curious to explore every object around him by touching or picking it up it's a burning desire in uh, in a kid to conquer the world he's curious all the time this is shushrusha from mental notes kids will smile at familiar faces or cries at is looking at the stranger or throws tantrums at mother this is shravan because he has taken mental notes right and just by listening about of animals or birds or fruits a kid is able to recognize whether it's an apple or a it's a bird or a, an animal right how beautifully human beings are blessed with these three um, excellences right from the birth similarly you would have heard of successful ceos or players um or leaders talking about having a good coaches in their life and how they have helped them so in coaching parallels um, the session starts with um, chemistry um, and when i say chemistry meaning knowing each other better and beyond the just name and title in the profession this is shushrusha whereas information gathering making notes using this notes for further development and achieving the goals or the objectives of coaching is all about shravan and grahan thus all three qualities are very important for a successful coach let's pause for 30 seconds and take a stock up where do we stand on these three excellences as we are on the journey of leadership excellence close your eyes on a scale of 1 to 5 rate yourself 1 mean never and 5 mean always ask yourself do i accept when i don't know and enough do i look at situations people place from the point of view of 
how I, I, what I want to learn more about them? Or do I listen, watch, read, discuss with an open mind? Or do I listen to them with uh, judgment? Do I make a conscious effort to absorb the information? Do I revise and revisit the learning till I'm confident of about my understanding on the topic? Hope. This gave you some idea about learning attitude and triggered you some thoughts what needs to be worked on. In fact, yesterday I was reading about um, McKinsey's new book launch, that is CEO's Excellence, which is about the six mindset, which actually um, is uh, about the, also about the leadership lessons from 67 CEOs across the world for, for successful companies. And remember, we started our topic with Swami or a leader is a mindset as defined by Acharya Chanakya. Wow, Kathalya Tishas called Swami or leader is, is, a, is a mindset and wrote 51 excellences thousands years back. And today we are trying to explore and doing the still doing the research around it. Hope this makes you curious to learn more about these 51 excellences of Swami or a leader. Connect with us to partner with you in this journey of making of a Swami. Gratitude to Acharya Chanakya. Namaste.